All right, in this video, I'm going to introduce you to the concat function. So this is a function that we can use inside the SQL language to concatenate two or more fields together into a single value. So if you remember, we already did one function where we were doing select star from, let's do the employees again. So remember, we're, we're doing the select star, or I'm sorry, the, the function is count. So we're gonna count everything and you get a count. So that is a, a function inside the select clause. And what we wanna do now is do a concat. Like so. And you can see that it can concatenate those names together. So I can do as name. And if I wanna do a, a actually name to give it a more friendly name. And we, we can do things like first name. So I want you to visualize that. So you can see here, so we have Georgie Facello, and you can see now how it's all together like so. But the problem is that we now have that, that all mushed together and we really don't want that. So what we can do is come up here and do single quote, space, single quote, comma, and that's gonna tell the concat function to put a space in there. So now we could uh, run that again. And now we can see that there's a nice space in there. And sometimes for reporting, you wanna do special characters in there. So you might wanna do something like uh, a separator. So I just used the pipe character, so I can run that again. And, uh, can see now that I have that, and that, that actually looks like an L in the output. So let's change that to a colon. And we can see things look a little bit better. So you can see down here in the screen how we now have the first name, space, colon, space, last name. So that's how the concat function works. Works quite nicely. Uh, you do use this a lot in when you're generating reports using SQL.